everyone, welcome to OCRP Tuesdays. In today's episode, we are trying to get as many infractions as possible without getting arrested, as well as introducing you to a new character of mine, Chao Tang. The end will shock you. A lot happens in this episode, so it will be split up into a few shorter parts, but enjoy and leave a like. Good evening, sir. Trooper Armstrong, San Andreas Highway Patrol. Uh, I assume you already know why I'm stopping you. I actually don't know. You don't know? Uh, not, not really. What? Why are you stopping me? Well, I mean, you're riding a wheelie down the interstate. Um, that's that's kind of illegal and dangerous. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Let me go ahead and get your license, registration, and proof of insurance on the motorcycle, please. Alrighty, here's all that stuff for you. And then uh, I will get you the license. My name's uh, Chow Tang. Chow Tang? Uh, common spelling, I assume? Yes. Alright, Mr. Tang, sit tight. How's it going? I'm doing pretty good. It's a nice bike you got here. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Just got it today. Is it a uh, red or black? I'm having a little trouble. Or is it like pearlescent? The base coat is black. It's uh, got a little red tint to it on the top of it. So I guess it would be pearlescent. Okay. Oh, man. It's not. It's registered as black, though. But I got you. I'm sure that, that, that wouldn't make a big deal anyway. I love it. I love how certain ways the light hits it and it's one color and then another color, you know? Just uh. Yeah, when I great. pulled up, it looked black, and then I'm standing here and I can see a little tint of red on it. Yeah, yeah. All right, sir. Uh, are you from out of state by chance? No, I live off of a 200 or 2008 uh, northeast or north. Calafio Way. Okay. Are you sure Chow Tang is your actual name? Yep. Uh, yeah, it's it's uh, Chow Tang. All right, let me go check again, sir. Alrighty. I hope the DMV ain't having issues with that. Hopefully not. Everything's registered. It's all approved. <laughs> What would he stop you for? You don't uh, mind me asking. Doing a wheelie down the interstate. Ah, oh, I gotcha. Yeah, I'm just trying to have a little fun out here tonight, you know? Oh, these troopers, man. Terrible. No, I'm kidding. I think I think most of it's just safety issue. Yeah, I understand. I, I mean, I race for a living, so... <laughs> yeah, no, I, uh... I mean... I pulled over someone earlier who claimed that they were like a professional uh, street racer and stuff like that. And I had to reassure him, like, look, you might be a professional, but the people around you are not. So, yeah, yeah, exactly. You you might be able to control what you do with your bike, but you might you can't control what people do with their cars or their trucks or their bike. Yeah, I completely understand. Hi, right, Mr. Thing. I found you on a system here. I guess my computer had a little glitch in it or something. You got a pretty, I'm sorry. You have a pretty clean record. I am all for trying to keep that. 
but if I see you doing that again, you're definitely going to get a citation. Right now, you're just going to get a verbal warning. Quit that. It's It can be dangerous because already people do not pay attention to motorcycles for nothing. I see it all the time. Motorcycles getting hit, this, that, and the other, whatever. Just be safe, man. All right? Just just watch out for other people and everything. Wheelies don't help it. They that, That's taking your headlight and putting it out of people's view in their mirrors and stuff when they're driving down the interstate and whatnot so you know just be safe be watchful all righty all righty thank you for the warning yes sir you have a good one you too you be safe out there we'll try it all right sir appreciate the backup bro yep no no problem man. have a good one Tried. Thank you. I like your bike. Thank you. You're way faster than I am. It looks like you got a GTR. That I do. You, you, you might be able to keep up. You know, I'll play a spring, go prove this. Uh, no. Not really. Do you? The only thing I think it would be the freeway. Uh, okay. I just don't know how to get back there. Uh, hang on. Of course, I have a bike myself. I could always uh, go and get it. If you want, it doesn't bother me either way. Yeah, well, we could try the GTR. Uh, only thing I could think of would be just down to here and then take a left here. Take a left at this light and then head down Yeah, we would take a left, and then it would take us to the uh, site Olympic Freeway. So we take a left down, and we would go on this roadway here, and then it would take us past Capitol Boulevard to the Olympic Freeway and quite get hit, hit that. Okay, I mean, you okay? Take a left here, and then go up to the freeway. Hopefully, I don't get lost. <laughs> yeah, or you can just follow me. I usually don't. Uh, I usually don't hang out. Oh, sorry about that. I usually don't hang out very much around here. I'm usually up in the county, but uh, sa we could definitely try. Same here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, why not? I know there's a ton of cops out, but hey, they can't catch us, right? That's true. They can't catch us, so.
Do you guys not pay attention to who's around? I will draw away. Hello. Is that your motorcycle? You almost hit me, bro. Oh, I didn't almost hit you. If I almost hit you, then I would hit you. Uh, maybe you should be parked on the curb, next to an inch inch. And uh, find a parking spot. Hey, you burrow. Is it no one? Is it? Yeah, hello. He's a sexy. Hey, this is corporal sexy, Pete. Watching yeah, they I'm are. I'm looking at your car while you guys all jumped into mine. And... Yeah, he is. Oh. And he keeps rolling right by. Just keep going. Keep going. Why don't you go shoot your pants? Yeah, you're kind of smelling up my car here, man. He sure what? Alright. Alright, so the plan is, is to go up. His, his armpits are so toxic, he's eating his jack. That yeah, way. Yeah, we can take this freeway. Yeah, and then uh, just gotta remember where the off ramp is, or the on ramp is. There, it's just straight ahead, um, if I remember correctly. Um, there's gonna be a cop sitting up that way somewhere. Well, that makes it fun. At least I have these guys with me. I guess they that have been held hostage, so. Yeah, yeah. I don't think they're gonna catch me though. Okay, they won't catch you, but they might catch me. Uh, 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 yeah, right. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, let's do this. Uh, the Sandy Shores ex exit, that takes you to Yellowjack. Okay. If not farther. Alright, sounds good.
three cops for a little bit of speed. Get off the bike. I I don't know what's going on. Off the bike. We'll explain to you what's going on. You get off the bike, we'll give you security. Um Alright. You are you gonna put handcuffs on me? For a little bit of speed. Off the bike. We'll talk about that in a minute, man. Just hop off. We'll get it all worked out. All right. Well. Turn around, face away from us. Put your hands up. You got lethal. Yeah, I got you covered. Don't move. All right, sir. Where were you about five minutes ago? Up on a bridge. Up on a bridge. And am I going to find a weapon on you? Well, yeah. Of course you're going to find a weapon on me. Why were you shooting at me? I wasn't shooting at you at all. Why did you shoot? I didn't mean to. Yeah. You didn't mean to, but like, so like you just had your gun in your hand for just no apparent reason. Well, it wasn't supposed to be out. Flying at me doing 123 down the freeway, so Okay, but if, if, it, if it shot, it, it, something's either hung on the trigger and shot it, or you had it in your hand for a reason. Uh, well, I might have accidentally pulled the trigger, but I did not mean to even have it in my hand at the moment in time. Where were you pointing it at? Uh, in the mountains. Not even remotely towards anybody or anything. Why would you just stop in the middle of the road, pull your gun out, and just point it somewhere? I wasn't on the in the middle of the road. I was on the side of the bridge. Okay, but there's no shoulder on that bridge, so technically it's the middle of the road. Isn't You're the not line like off to a side? Isn't the line classified as a shoulder technically? Since there is, there is, just, I was literally on that other side of the line, not even in the middle of the road. Okay, but you're, you're still on the side of the road. I'm on a traffic stop with somebody, explaining something to them, and then I hear a shot fired, and then see you up on a bridge. So what? What? I mean, what do you think our reaction is going to be? Oh, I completely understand. I I didn't mean to uh, do anything like that. I was trying to wave. With a gun in your hand. Not with a gun in my hand. It wasn't even supposed to be there in the first place. And I and I accidentally shot up into the the, the mountain range over, over there. All right. Are you gonna have anything on you besides the gun that's gonna poke me, stick me, or hurt me? Oh, definitely not. All right. Well, I'm gonna patch you down here. Go right ahead. All right, sir. Just have a seat here. I'm going to talk with uh, I'm going to talk with this other officer right here. We'll figure out something here. Alrighty, no problem. I'm I'm being a hundred percent honest oh, with you guys. Chowting. Um, so this whole situation with the highway unit, he's saying that you accidentally discharged your firearm. Uh, is that you're trying to wave at him or something like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wasn't meaning to uh, pull a trigger on my firearm at all. Okay, I got you. All right. Um, 
So here's here's the situation. Um, I understand the situation with the, the accidental discharge. I'm not going to charge you anything for that. I'm just going to pretend that didn't happen. Um, but the speeding on the bike. You want to know what I clocked you at coming down the freeway? How fast? 123. So. Oh man, speed, I need to get that faster. The, the speed limit here on the freeway, I believe, is 65. Um, so that's going to be uh, 60 or so miles an hour over the speed limit, okay? Um, so unfortunately, that's going to be an automatic suspension of your license, and I'm going to have to tow your bike, okay? So, Alrighty. Uh, you're uh, you're not under arrest. You're gonna be free to go here in a second once I get through this paperwork. Um, if you'd like, I can call you a taxi, or if you have a friend that can come pick you up. But uh, unfortunately, I can't let you go away on your bike. Okay. Alrighty, alrighty. Um, how long is that? Has my license suspended for? Uh, that's up for the judge to decide. Um, I'm not sure the exact statute. I'd have to look it up. Um. So I, so I, you know, I, I really can't tell you on the side of the road here, uh, but I'd imagine it's probably a couple of months at least. Maybe right. I'm not sure. So uh, just sit tight for me. I'm gonna figure out this paperwork here, and uh, we'll get you underway. Are uh, my. Uh my SMG and my pistol going away as well? Uh, no, you'll be able to keep those. Alrighty, alrighty. Yeah, no, I, uh, I understand what you're saying with the whole, uh, accidental discharge thing. Uh, did you want me to call you a taxi? Or, uh, did you have somebody come pick you up? You gonna walk? What's the deal there? I, I can walk. Okay, no problem. All right, in that case, I'm gonna go ahead and pull you out here. Just go ahead and watch your head. All right, come over here, sir. Just walk over under the grass here and I'll get those cuffs off you. You okay, baby? All right, and uh, you're gonna be free to go. Okay, I'm gonna give you this copy of this paperwork here. Uh, it's gonna be a court summons. Okay, they're gonna want to talk to you about uh, your license and your bike. Uh, your bike's gonna be taken down to impound, and you can uh, contact the judge about getting that back. Okay. Alrighty, thank you. All right, here are your firearms back, as well as your other belongings, and you are free to go. All right, thank you. All right, have a good night, sir. Thank you for watching my new character Chow Tang and his adventures. Hit the like button and subscribe for more OCRP adventures. You have a wonderful day and we'll see you next time.